Hi friends, in this video you are going to see the features of Freedom OS which runs on top of Android in Swipe Lite Plus. Let's click on the app drawer and you can notice the interface similar to stock Android but it has some extra apps pre-installed. Let's pull down the notification bar down and you can notice quick toggles. If you further swipe down you can notice the main toggles here you can increase or decrease the brightness. On the home screen you can see the search bar when you click on that you can notice that it is not Google search bar but it is swipe custom search bar. When you type anything in it, it gives uh, app results as well as uh, related keywords. Press and hold on the home screen. You can see variety of options such as swipe customize wallpaper themes, system settings, swipe launcher setting. We will see each one of these individually. Click on swipe customize, click on app drawer. When you click on app drawer, you can see that you can customize the app drawer look. And you can even change the outline for your app drawer. Click on OK. Now let's see on the home screen. You can see that the app drawer logo has been changed. Click on swipe customize again. Click on effects. You can change the effects of your choice uh, when you move from one window to other window. And you can even change the layout also 4x4, 5x4. You can have the folder looks of iOS or Android. You can even hide the status bar also. By default, it is set to on. But if you turn off the status bar, you can see that status bar has disappeared from your home screen. If you click on again, it will show up. And similarly, notification bar. By default, it is set to on. As you can see, that toggle notification is showing up. If we turn off this notification, uh, toggles will not be shown. So let's turn it on again. You can even hide the labels. The labels means the app name. Let's click on wallpaper. You can change the wallpaper of your choice. Similarly, you can add the themes. Here are a variety of themes you can download and install. Another good option is swipe launcher settings. Click on that and it will give you a variety of options. When you open the app drawer, you can see that there are there is no groups. Let's create the group for apps. Go to app drawer, scroll down and click on, click on add group. Uh, click on place and select the apps which you would like to group. Click on OK. Now let's go back and click on the app drawer and you can see that beside app there is an option called groups. When you click on that it will show the list of apps which you have grouped and go to swipe launcher settings again and here we have the gestures option. Okay uh, we can use the when you when you swipe up uh, it will open the swipe search and when we swipe down it will open the notifications okay. When you double tap on the screen, it will wake up. I will show this later. You can change the names of the apps. For example, I am ch changing the name of the Flipkart app. Press and hold on the app. It will give you an option called rename. Click on that. Enter the name of your choice and click on OK. You can see that the app name has been changed to a custom name. You can't rename the system apps. If you can see properly the quick toggles to customize this one, you need to click on more and click on the three dots on the top right. If you want to change the downloads to another app, you can do that. When you press on Gmail, you can see that downloads has been replaced by Gmail. Similarly, we can replace the toggles. Let's um, bring down the quick notification toggle bar and you can see that you have the uh, new toggles. Now let's see another feature of this phone. As you can see that the phone is in sleep mode. To wake it up, just double tap on the screen. The phone will wake up. If you can see properly, we have quick toggles as well as shortcuts. If you can see properly, uh, he, over here we have calculator, uh, selfie camera, audio recording. We can customize these shortcuts. To customize these shortcuts, let's unlock and go to settings. And go to lock screen. And click on function. Here at the bottom you have some more options to if you want alarm instead of sound recording you can do that. Click on these three dots, three lines and just drag and drop. You can see that sound recording is disabled and set alarm is enabled. Now let's go back and see in the lock screen. Here you can see that we have the alarm option. That's it guys. Here are the, some of the features of Freedom OS on your Swipe Elite Plus. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe to our channel. Thank you.